All right, guys, what is up? It is me, NLDT Studios, and today I bring you my hermit crab cage. All right, as you can see, I've got a few hermit crabs in there. Well, that one's not in its shell right now. He's in that thingy back there. So, I have their tank at a cozy 50% humidity and 74.8 degrees Fahrenheit, or as already dropping stuff, or as English people like to say, 23.3 degrees Celsius. We get it. This is very hard. There we go. All right, and let's just say I got all these crabs at PetSmart locations. And that's the sensor to that. And I wanted to show you guys this. All right. So you guys might be thinking, what the hell is this thing? Well, it is an air pump recirculator that hosts water. So it's basically just a giant water pump. So that's an air pump for fish tanks. I repurposed it, repurposed all their cords and stuff, and even used a little bit of my own stuff. Eh, what ifs? Seems uh, one of my crabs is enjoying himself already in the new bathtub. So basically what this does is it uses air pressure to pump water up, as you can see, through the big wide tube up there and then up into here. Now this is sort of like a catch basin and it's basically attached to a straw. I don't know why I just use a straw. I just use a straw because that was the only thing available. That and it will last a lot longer. And so basically the water comes from in there, whatever is collected here, or whatever comes into that contact with that straw will get sucked into there, which goes into there, which goes straight down into the water. Let's see, I think there's a one coming off the edge right there. See, ta-da! And then the crabs, as you can see, just climb in and out of their little pool and they enjoy themselves. So that's just a bunch of shells and stuff I've put in the cage just to keep fun. So yeah, that's basically my hermit crab cage. Yes, that is a giant shell. No, your eyes do not deceive you. That is a giant shell. I've got two of them now. All because of this guy. So yeah, sadly, um, I've got bad news because um, one of my hermit crabs actually passed away. I'm actually going to get his shell right now. Hey, uh, his name was, uh, Bat Crab, mostly because of, well, this. He lived in this shell. I didn't have him for very long. I, I assume this was from when they transported him, question mark? I don't know. But, um, he passed away. I buried him in my backyard. He wasn't responding at all to anything, and so, basically, I just kind of buried him, and I said my farewells. Not too quickly, but not too slow either, so... I was pretty upset, and um, what I've got to do now is just fill up that basin right there, and then during the school hours, I'm going to keep this thing on, because since I'm not here, and my mom doesn't exactly like my hermit crabs, I just got to keep it going, so, yeah. Hey, it's climbing up! I hate this hydrometer so much. Uh, great choice, hydrometers. You guys suck at making hydrometers. Like, seriously, every five minutes I'm looking over and I'm like, oh my god, I need to spray their cage, like, now. Because it says that it's at, like, 30%, even though it's at probably, what, 70? So, yeah, that's basically my hermit crab cage. Who are you talking crab. to? So, yeah, that's basically my hermit crab cage for the day. And, yeah, I made that myself out of duct tape and a couple of pipes. And a water pump. Thank you, Aquafine. So, yeah. That's basically it.